cost, uh -huh. we have to select plan cost and under plan cost, we have uh, manual cost planning under WBS element. So I'm going to select unit costing. So there are oh. few, few um, okay. These are the item category which we have to deal for unit costing and valuation variant and costing variant. These are the two important parameters which decide. Are you uh, recording this? Yeah, yeah, I've started recording. Okay. So Thank you. The, these two impo important configuration will decide how cost will be calculated. Okay, how costing will be performed at uh, by using a unit costing. So we'll mm -hmm. discuss what is the costing variant, okay? Mm -hmm. So, so costing variant transaction code is OKKT, okay? And uh, I've shared one book okay, KP. in Google Drive, yeah. So uh, in Google Drive, actually, uh, uh, th this is one book, PS book, May 2007. So this is the name of that book. And uh, if you uh, go to page number 82, you will get transaction code for um, configurations. So what you can do, oh, very you, nice. just, you just write uh, these transactions on, on a paper and uh, you just paste that paper in front of your table so that you will, uh, you'll, uh, you will have, a, uh, you will uh, quickly remember what is the decode for project profile, what is the default decode for network profile. Is, is this document, uh, okay, configuration document, the one you have now? No, no, it's, uh, it includes all uh, it oh, includes okay, okay, features as well as configuration, as well as tables, everything. Okay, okay. reports information. Okay, so let's proceed. Uh, oh, wait, I, I, where did, how did you come to this? Sorry, I missed this. Can you go back, please? Sorry. Okay, okay. so SPRO, under mm -hmm. SPRO, Projects. I've selected project. So under mm -hmm. project, I've selected cost. Okay. Mm -hmm. Under cost, plan cost. Okay. And mm -hmm. under plan cost, I have one node, which is manual cost planning. Okay. Okay. And under manual cost planning, I'm selecting unit costing. Very under nice. Unit Thank costing, you. create costing variant. So one costing mm -hmm. variant is already created for easy cost planning. And second is for unit costing, PS01. Mm -hmm. So when I double click on this, okay. so so you will get costing variant for unit uh, unit costing PS01 and it includes costing type, valuation variant and date control. Costing okay. type, basically uh, we just select costing type as per the standard, okay? So if you go to drop down list, you will get the costing types. So oh. there is no need to uh, disturb the standard function, standard configuration. Yes. But in valuation variant, you can um, choose how value will be calculated with reference to unit costing. So whenever we are dealing with material, okay. So in CJ40 screen, slash O CJ40. Okay. And uh, if I select same project, okay. Mm -hmm. Uh, if I select file level WBS element and if I select material, okay. Mm -hmm. So in that case, how material plant will be calculated. So firstly, it will check plant price. Second, it will check standard price. Mm -hmm. Third, it will check moving average price. So I, I know where the standard price and moving average prices are in accounting one tab. Where is this plant yeah, price? Accounting one. Accounting one too? Okay. Plant prices, uh, you manually enter price. Okay. Plant price is nothing but manually enter price. That's, that, that's it's it. still coming from material master, right? Yeah. So yeah, this, okay. this, for this, for this material, it is coming from material master. Okay. Got it. Next for activity type plant price. Okay. So firstly, it, it will have priorities. Okay. So firstly, it will check plant price as an average of all his career trades. Second, uh, most up to date plan price. Okay. So this is the price which we maintain in KP26 transaction. Okay. Yes. Per hour. Next yes. for subcontracting net purchase order price. Okay. And for external processing price so, from operation and price net net quotation price. Okay. So got it. This fetching as per uh, purchase info record and mm. uh, overheads. Okay. So uh, you, you are having question, right? 
uh, why it is calculating always overheads. So if yes. I press back, okay. Yes, I want to save it. So you just observe this value, okay. This value four three four three four eight, okay. It it will have three line line items got added, okay. So I'll show you why these three line items got added. So under overhead tab. Uh, if you click on costing sheet under costing sheet uh, uh, they have defined with reference to this costing sheet what will be the costing row and overhead rates okay so one two three and four four material overhead production manufacturing overhead admin overhead and sales overhead okay, okay. so if i choose only one material overhead and uh, if i select what is from overhead, 10 uh, I'll, I'll explain you that also. So okay. valid from to valid date, controlling yes. area and overhead type. So this overhead type is nothing but actual overhead rate and planned overhead rate because actually currently we are planning the cost. So that's why this second line item will trigger because we are planning the cost for this controlling area. Five percent is the material overhead. So this value the uh, five percent of this value is nothing but overhead of material that's it and uh, if you check first line item so for first line item they don't have any overhead dates overhead. okay so oh. navigation is not possible if i select manufacturing overhead they they are having some rates oh i've selected two line items uh okay so for manufacturing also they have five percent for overhead mm -hmm. And uh, for next admin, admin also they have five percent, I guess. Twenty percent. Twenty percent. And for sales overhead, fifteen percent. Okay, five percent, twenty percent, and fifteen percent. Five percent of what? Five percent of this value, no? Of the total value. Three, uh, three zero six seven. Yeah. Oh. Total value. Okay. So this is um this is how. Oh, wait, 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 wait. No, 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 no. Go back. Uh, go, go back to costing sheet again. Okay. Uh, go to overhead uh, costing sheet uh, rows. Uh, what is this? Uh, uh, ten to from ten to from thirty to from. from. On the right side, from column to row. Okay. Uh, if, you don't, if, if you don't know, that's fine. Don't worry about it. Okay. No, actually, I am. I'm not aware about it. So I'll have to uh, explore why why they have uh, actually this costing sheet. I haven't worked earlier, so that's why uh, I'll I'll check from and to and what is the credit. This will be created by finance people. Yeah, huh, finance people. Yes. Base, B, calculation base. Okay. PS zero zero. Yeah. See, this is mm. condition type. Mm. Okay. That's fine. Don't worry. Okay, from ten. Oh, from row ten all the way till. Uh, Row twenty, it is E zero one. Ten to forty. Okay. What is E zero one? Click on credit. Huh. I think it gives a jail account. I think. E zero one, which is credit material. E zero. All right. Uh, okay, I got it. Okay, highlight that row. Okay. Highlight that E zero one and click on credit. Credit. Controlling area 1000. And there you go. See, that's the cost element it cost uses. Cost element and cost center. Center. That's where it gets posted. Yeah, right. In case of actual. I think you need to press back arrow, I guess. Yeah. So if I take. Okay, so it is from 10 to 10 all the way till. Okay, 50 okay, to 20. 70. Yeah. So if you. Five zero to seventy, fifty to seventy. 
so cost of goods goods sold uh, uh these row 50 to 70 50 60 70 yes. those will be considered yeah this is the 10 to 40 will be from uh, material to material manufacturing cost yeah cost of goods manufacture okay now it sounds good okay yeah, thank you huh? yeah so this is about costing uh, variant, variant. Sorry, valuation variant and date control is also um, standard configuration costing date from costing date to it will be the manual entry or start of the month so basically this uh, uh, unit costing is not relevant for periods so that's why this this date control will not uh, work because in cj40 screen we we are not distributing this cost uh, among the particular periods 